Hey guys, okay, so this is going to be the last product that I review tonight while I'm on my um, my e.l.f. Um, product review kick, kick and this is the e.l.f. Lip Balm SPF 15 The reason I'm reviewing this is actually because I quite like it but I think it's a bit weird at the same time and I have issues with um, something that they claim it does but it could just be me so it's a uh, lip balm, it has um, SPF in it which I think is brilliant because a lot of lip balms don't and you know wearing something like Vaseline or whatever is not protecting your lips from the sun and from its rays in fact it's doing the opposite so um, I think it's in, it is important to get um, lip balms that have some protection this says relieves and soothes lips with a drench of moisture now it does feel quite moisturising when it's on but I wouldn't say it's soothing now I don't know if it's just me but the first time I ever put this on, and I'll show you what it looks like, it just comes like this. And it's quite trans... what's it? Transparent, translucent. Um, it's just like a stick uh, lip balm. It reminds me of like uh, the MAC um, lip primer in how it looks. But when I first put this on, it stung my lips like hell. I mean, my lips are actually... it was quite uncomfortable. I wouldn't go as far as saying it's sore, but it was uncomfortable, it was unpleasant. And I had to wait a good while before that like subsided. Um, but I wanted to give it a go. I wasn't just going to take it off and, um, you know, throw it out. So after that one use, first use, it didn't hurt or wasn't that uncomfortable again afterwards. But it definitely tingles. And if anything, I'd say it feels like it's um, it's irritating a little bit, but not so much so that um, I've kind of gotten used to it, which is not something that you'd particularly do on a normal, you know, generally, but because I was testing this out, I gave it a good few chances and now I'm kind of over it so I can happily use it. Um, and I actually like how it makes my lips look. It does moisturise them, but it kind of makes them feel, okay, this is going to sound like completely um, contradictory, but it makes them feel tight, like, um, kind of makes them look like they're PVC or something. I don't know if that's like the right way of describing it at all but it doesn't you know the way it's usually when you um when you moisturize your lips it makes them feel nice and plump and moist but this doesn't make them feel plump by any means it makes them kind of feel tight but still like conditioned or um like they're moisturized it's kind of hard to explain but i really do like that it has the spf in it um and that's really all that it says here but I kind of like the way it makes my lips, lips look like that but for some reason as well since I find it kind of irritating it makes my lips go quite um quite red so I don't like I was surprised when I saw that this wasn't actually like a lip plumping or you know um one of those ones that's supposed to do something other than just moisturize this probably isn't good for me but like it it stim it seems to irritate them um and make them go quite red but like my lips aren't dry or chapped or anything afterwards so it doesn't really bother me but um, I think you'd need to be careful with this one because it might be too irritating for you and then again you might be someone who it doesn't irritate whatsoever so you might need to just try it out and um, I'd be interested to see if anyone else has had um, the same issue with this um, but like I said I've kind of grown used to it and I kind of like it now so I am going to keep using it um, and this was from the studio range again and it was um, 350 but yeah that's the lip balm with the SPF 15 in it so um, if you want to see any more reviews on any of the products that I haven't reviewed let me know and I'll see um, if I can get around to it and in the meantime thanks a million for watching guys I'll talk to you really soon. Salon.